I've been together with Andrew for six years, and I know he's been cheating for six years due to his behavior, due to what I saw on his phone quite a few times. And not only that, disappearing at random times, not telling me that he'll be back, return back late at night, like at 12 or 11, or basically telling people that he's married to me and then telling other people that I just found out that he's not married to me. He lives a double life. He'll smell like sex coming home. Me and Andrew have mutual friends and that's why I know he's up to, I know he's cheating. And I know he has someone pregnant. I kicked Andrew out because he's been cheat he's cheating on me with somebody else's wife. I, I think Andrew tried to hook up with my sister because she looks like me, for one. Two, she's always there when there's an issue occurring. And three, she, she doesn't get on him about what I get on him at actually when he's in my home. So he said that she's trying to come on to me, she's trying to stay over the house and sleep with me. As Soon as I confront my sister about it, she's like, that never happened. Okay, if Andrew fails, I'm, I want a divorce. I deserve way better. I deserve a husband that's gonna be there for me and, my, and our kids. I just tired of being lied to and I just want all the truth and nothing but the truth. I don't have any reason to step out on her. She's never given me a reason to. You know, I've been going through this for quite a few years with her and, you know, it's not fair to me. You're ripping our family apart and, you know, you're listening to everybody else instead of coming to the one person that you chose to be in your life. So you say you've never cheated on her? No. Okay. Never. Uh, why does she believe that you have someone pregnant? Because I gain weight. Because See? you gain weight? Yes. Because when she was pregnant, I gained weight. I'm gaining weight. I, I work out, I eat, I work for construction, and I do DoorDash, so I'm constantly moving. I mean, how much weight are you talking about that you gained? Maybe, maybe like five pounds. I mean, that's not even noticeable. I mean, come like on. She says she could see it in my face, Steve. Yeah. Uh, and now, I understand why you would try to get with her sister. Why does she think that you tried to get with her sister? Well, I believe that she, I believe that her sister is saying this. Because, you know, from everything that her you sister You ever think about her said, sister in a sexual way? No. Never? No. She's not even my type. She, she's exact, they're twins. No, two different weight classes. <laughs> now, I, I heard that you lied and said that you did cheat. Yes. Why'd you do that? Because what happens is, if she, what she does is she'll accuse me yeah. of doing it, okay? And then you think, and then she, well, no, no, if I finally then say that out, I did, yeah. She'll kick me out, and the only way that I can speak to her or my children is if I admit to doing something, even if I have it. But that's a bad plan to I make. understand that. Yeah. But my, my kids are more important than anyone. Now, she thinks that you're sleeping with a married woman. Yes. And why is that? Well, because... Um, when I was still at the house, I had this game on the phone. Um, it's called Avakin Life. It's like a social game, kind of like The Sims. And, you know, you interact with other people. And uh, there was a young lady on there. Well, said it was a, she said she was a married young lady. And, you know, we kind of were talking back and forth. But and it this never, is a real person? I guess. So now you took a lie detector test, right? Yes. You, now, you don't have any question whether Alexis cheated on you, right? No, not in my mind. Okay. So you're here, and you took one whether you cheated on her. Yes. Or cheating, or if you got somebody pregnant. Right. Now, if you got somebody pregnant, that would be really bad, right? Right. Mm. How, many, how many children do you have with Alexis? I have two biologically one, and one the So you one have three? Possibly, yes. So three children all together. Three biologically, yes. Yeah, but I'm saying, so you have your hands full already? Yes. Yeah. You don't need... No. With no. And you want to stay in this marriage? Yes. All right, well, let's, uh, let's meet your wife. Every time you allow somebody else to be around you, they always convince in you, I'm the problem. I know I have my problems. But my whole thing is this. The way you're going about this 
is not only wrong, it's unfair to our family. <laughs> I'm just gonna tell you this, just like the stand standards that you stand for, you don't stand for it. There's no integrity. Two, I take care of the kids more than you do. You duck and dodge and sleep with people. You smell like sex when you come home, first of all. So you Second say. Second of all. So you up, say. Hold up, I let you talk, okay? I was being respectful, now you can be respectful. We're both adults, right? Okay. So. See, that's the attitude the problem. Look at this, mm -hmm. look at this. And the fact is, I don't deserve to be cheated on. I did go in your phone, you did cheat. And you have been sleeping no. around. Mm -hmm. And the fact is, is that you shouldn't be smelling like sex coming home. We don't screw like that like we used to. Really? You're nasty, you're disgusting, no. you're a narcissist, mm -mm. and you like to control me. You broke my family up, you said my mm -mm. sister wants you, you basically always think you're desirable. Do you know I can do better? Alexis, your twin sister, Anisha, made us a tape. Let's watch that now. My sister's husband, Andrew, is a conniving liar, cheater, and not just that, he treats her like she's a, she, she's just his, his free ticket of a free place and doesn't do his responsibilities, she does everything. I don't want my sister with Andrews because he lied, he cheated on her, even before marriage, she's been cheating on her. Andrew be on some talking, always talking trash about his wife, his wife, she's not free spirit like you. Like you cool, you into video games, you into all this extra stuff. Of course I am because I like those things. But you know, like he, every time he talks, it's just so negative about my sister, but he compliments me. He's just sitting here lying about that, that I tried to come on to him because I'm the way I am. I like having my cleavage out a little bit. I like the way I dress. I don't want to be bandaged up. I'm beautiful. My sister deserves somebody that's going to let her be her, dress weird how she wants to. I don't, she dress real nice, and not just that, let her get her hair done. Let her do stuff, fun with the kids, and do it with the, her and the kids. Don't make her do absolutely everything around there, and at least give her some help with money too. And when it comes to the kids, give them all your full undivided attention. If you don't pass the lie detector test, I want them to get a divorce. I want him to like, he's not even good for the kids. I want a divorce. We asked him, while in a relationship with Alexis, did you have sexual contact with any other woman? He answered no. While in a relationship with Alexis, did you have sexual intercourse with any other woman? He answered no. At this time, is there another woman pregnant with your child? He answered no. Did you have or try to have any sexual activity with Anisha? He answered no. The results came back all the same, and they came back that Andrew did not tell the truth. I knew How? it! How? How? I knew it! You're not How? Home, no How? It's over. Okay. It's over. Well, I, I, I see hope my that kids, you get though. to some place where you can... You know, you a lot. You have I want to see my kids. Coach, okay. You coach the kids. No. So, Alexis... You have lied. I you just, have neglected, okay? I hope no. that... So, don't get here. No, 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 no. I hope that you get to no. a place... You can get a lie detector test with that one. You I can get one on that okay. one. On what? I hope that you get to You'll a be place back. where no. you can co-parent civilly. No. Good luck to you. Um, I just want to have you have a seat real quick. You are an unhappy man in an unhappy relationship. There's no reason to lie anymore. I understand you want to keep both worlds going, but you can... I don't have to. Can you... Steve, let, will I you don't. let me finish? Why wouldn't you just say, it's time to move on? Why would I move on from someone who gave me everything? But you don't have a lot. I understand that. I mean, if you watch this when you get back home, when this airs, I want you to watch it and then tell me, write me a little note and tell me if I'm wrong, okay? Good luck to you. I was right. My name is Steve Wilkos, and I'm an investigative talk show host with a law enforcement background. It was my life or his. My job is to get truth and justice for everyday people. Watch our videos now.